No. Um, when kids are stimming, of course, we want to allow that because it's a little sensory regulation snack, right? Um, okay. There are kiddos, I have students that I teach that stim while they're talking to me, and that's the mm-hmm. way they process, and that's fine, right? I just work around, and, and it doesn't, you know, I'm like, it is what it is. Um, but if I took that stimming away, they wouldn't be able to have a conversation with me. So I definitely mm-hmm. don't make them stop. If it is interfering in a kiddo able to, you know, like complete a task or they're really struggling, I think it is always great, especially if they say I need to play, right? I need to stem. That is okay. Um, And all you can say, and I've done this with kiddos, just say, let me know when you're ready. And lots of times when we give them that freedom to get that regulation, right? To get that regulation, to spin and get regulated for a couple of minutes, couple of seconds, they're ready. It's when we put a limit on it sometimes that makes them overwhelmed and then they need more of it, right? So I love that he's advocating for himself and asking to go play. And um, I don't have a problem with kids stimming while they're working. I have kiddos that hold something in their hand and can do a a writing and switch hands and do like they will work it out (laughs) as long as they get to keep this here. Now, I will say when a child has an object that is used for stimming or just security or just sensory input, um, if it is where they need both of their hands, one of the ways I help to reduce their anxiety around not wanting to relinquish that, not knowing if they're going to get it back is I will put like just a little, uh, a Uh, It could be like a piece of paper posted and I'll say you can put it right here, like on your desk, it's right here. And when you're finished, you can get it right. It's not going away or you can put it in your lap. And then when you're done, then, you know, if you're done with piano lessons, then you can pick it up. So not taking it away, but giving them an option so they know that they have access to it when they're ready for it. Um, Does that make sense? Yes. No, definitely. Yeah. Because he does carrying things around, like Mm -hmm. you'll find any object, like sometimes spoons, sometimes like Mm -hmm. little soft toys. Yes. Yeah, when he's carrying them. Yeah. Yes. 